runs out. Sandwich holder. Uh, trash. Insulated live well. Fully insulated. That ice has been here all day. And it is 5 p.m. And that ice has been in there all day. There's still plenty, plenty of ice in there. So plenty of ice. Something right here. This whole thing is removable. Removable console. Um, got this little kick panel right here. Throw extra stuff. Real nice real locker system for the passenger. And then net, storing your net, it's got an actual thing to store your net, strap it down, handles, seats move up and down, uh, so both of them, seats will slide up and down, uh, here's your deal. giant live wells those things go way up underneath here so I mean look and there are oxygenators um, this one right here like this the other cool thing about nitro these come out and you can put a spare prop right there or tools or anything so, or you can take that into your hotel battery compartments as clean as can be my jumper cables I'll take those out I mean you can see everything in here is super clean the pumps for the power poles batteries are everywhere. There's five batteries in this sucker. One, two, three, four, and five over here. Breakers are all rigged in real nice. This right here is something you'll never see. This is a uh, um, a cool well. So what you do is you fill this up with ice and then you run it with those switches down there. Those, those two down there. The top one's for this live well. The bottom one is for this live well. And it'll keep your live well cold. It'll drop your water temperature about 20 degrees. And it'll run it all day long. It'll just circulate it. That's a, uh, basically like an, air, an AC system there. So this is a really expensive system that comes with this boat. Um, power poles, perfect condition. 250 Pro XS, um, big old jack plate on it, hydraulic, uh, boarding ladder, everything's spick and span. Seats are in perfect condition. Everything's awesome. Two 12s, and then a 12 and a 9 up front. Here's this looks like 12 and a 9 hydrowave uh, power pole switches. Real nice setup there. 109 trolling motor. It's got all the I think these are like two or three hundred dollar mounts. There's one there and there's one here. See that thing? Things hard as heck to even take off. But every, you can see everything's real clean. I mean, the boat's in mint condition. Got the lights right here. So when you're in the morning or whatever, you light up your whole boat. That's it. Two, two smart craft gauges for everything you could ever dream of. One smart craft there and one, one there. Um, one person, light load. Boat goes in the low 70s. So I'm, I'm fully loaded down as you can see. Well, I'm not even fully loaded down, but I, 
I'm on a really small lake, and that's the whole lake right there. So I got up to 64, as you saw. So anyway, these things are amazing. Side images is what I do here, and I split uh, graph and and uh, sonar here, and it's a perfect combination. So anyway, the keyboard, the keypad's all digital. This thing's a bad mother, man. Got my car charger plugged in. So this is a power pole, and this right here is a power pole. So there's two of them. It does the same thing. Um, live well open and close, and this is the cool well system. Uh, this is uh, my live my live well, and this is the passenger's live well. If I want to light light his up, I just built a bunch of peanuts, as you saw. Hot foot, obviously. And then I've got a phone mount right here. Uh, that's what I was trying to show you. Phone mount right there, so your phone stays dry. Alarm system. So if there's any uh, bumps or, or anything, um, your boat rattles, your anything like that, your alarm will go off. Trim for the jack plate. Trim for the uh, motor. That's it, man. Thing's sweet. 2016. First come, first serve.